Hey there, comic book friends and fiends. It's Rob here in front of the Great Wall of Comics. It's that time. We've got ourselves our IRF Authentics Mystery Box. So let's take a look. All right, so more or less every month or so, IRF Authentics on Instagram at IRF Authentics uh, puts out this. They do the autographed mystery box. Uh, if you've seen this before, great. You know what I'm about to say. And if you haven't, well, sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride because every single thing in this box is signed. Sometimes multiple signings, some, I mean, triple, double, quadruple, whatever, remarked. It's all good. Um, so it's really a fun mystery box, especially if you like signed goods. Um, Ruben takes great care of curating these boxes, you know, so um, there was uh, in here this time also has his exclusive uh, book that he did. Um, so we'll see some of that uh, move this box out of the way. And so there are two mystery ba uh, boxes here in total. Actually, I picked up two. They are oops, we put that off to the side. Uh, box six and box 33. And then, uh, when I was doing it, cause I bought before I get to be part of their early, um, group or the pre-sale group. Uh, and then they were selling a special, uh, version of this new, of his exclusive book, which was the fan appreciation version. And on the fan appreciation version, um, they put... Uh, the names of their customers um, who've been on there before. So, and here we are. You can see right over here, Rob's Fat Stacks of Comics. Of course, that was my um, Instagram handle before I recently, I had recently changed an upgrade, but it doesn't matter. Rob's Fat Stack of Comics. I am on a printed magazine there, folks, or a printed comic book. That's Badass. Um, and so this is it. It's uh, ha Acts of Helena, uh, number one. Uh, this is the sketch variant. It's signed and dated. And this variant, the uh, f the version here that's for um, the fan base, there was uh, 25 of these, I think. Uh, yes, this is, num uh, according to the COA, this is number 17 of 25. So only 25 copies um, signed. My name on the back of it. Super cool. We'll put that off to the side. Um, let's see, then it looks like we had in here um, Ian Chase. Uh, Nichols is the artist of the month. Uh, special discount for IR affiliated customers uh, for 20% off your orders, original art, comics, remarks, and more. Enter code blah blah blah. All right, cool. So I might take like a look at that. Maybe I'll have him uh, do a sketch cover. All right, let's get into mystery boxes though. Uh, we have let's do we'll do a numerical order first, huh? Box six. Now, Ruben, I love the guy, uh, puts out good mystery boxes. He cares about how he packages these things and he listens to people because he has evolved his packaging. Um, I'm ruthless to people on their packaging all the time. Uh, and I've talked how much I dislike these uh, Tyvek mailers. Although he uh, argues that, and rightfully so, that, uh, you know, hey, look, for what he's doing, it's just simple, easy way to do this. It's quick when you're assembling all these boxes, whatever. But he's now made it where it's already only part of it is adhered and part is not so there's less um it's not the whole thing it just kind of pulls pulls off and if everybody did that i would be a much happier guy um so let's pull these books out careful all right let's flip these face down i'm gonna guess i don't know if there's an order to them or not but we'll start with this. I see this is, um, oh, okay. I got to go the other direction. I think because I don't want to reveal that. That's like the big hit to me. All right. So first one up here, we have uh, Hawkeye number one, uh, Kate Bishop. 
and this is so signed by uh, Todd Novak or not Todd Knock Novak is Knock Todd Knock that's cool Hawkeye keep Bishop number one cool spec book we got uh, Justice Justice League Incarnate uh, three of five and it's got notes on it here that this is the first appearance of the Nimrod squad earth 41 version of Youngblood and first appearance of Spore you know what's funny actually as I've read that I actually think I've gotten this book before um, signed by Dennis Culver <laughs> I honestly think I um, that's all right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Check this one out, guys. It's Micronauts. What? <laughs> oh, and this one is signed. Was this? What are you saying? Oh, this is Janice Chang. Okay. I got confused for a second because there's a whole list of names on the back of the inside of here. Um, I think maybe this was like a list that was put in here of people that were associated with the book just that way you know like he sets up his book sides as he goes to cons knowing who can sign it and maybe he intended to try to have it multiple signed but it didn't i don't know but anyways cool okay micronauts that's fun um this is a book that was a big big book um as our at the time i think this was like so this was like when they revealed the Batwoman Beyond stuff. This is signed by Dan Jurgens. So comic legend Dan Jurgens, uh, Batman Beyond issue thirty nine. I love Batman Beyond almost as much as I love Spider Man twenty ninety nine. What what? Although this story hasn't been all that great. Here we got the Ken Lashley uh, cover uh, cover variant, and it is signed by Ken Lashley. So that's cool. Let's see if I can get that signature up there. There we go. Awesome. And then, whoo, exclusive variant. This month's featured artist. There he is, Ian Nichols, the Tick. Don't 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 loved the Tick. The Tick was so great. Oh man. Here's a. Another, here's the colored version of the book, uh, Acts of Helena. There's only a hundred copies of this that are colored and signed. Apparently this, uh, COA surprise, this copy, Acts of Helena number one, is a print run of 100 copies, exclusive for our authentic signed by artist. Yeah. So there you go. So we've got the 25 issue and the 100 issue. Although the 100 issue does not have the, um, my name doesn't have my name on it. Only the 25 does. And this is what I saw on the backside. This got me super stoked. This is amazing. Oh my God. I love, I love sketch covers. I would seen on the back that said sketch cover and it then said the tick. Ian Nichols, check that out on a black crossover. The tick. Or is that white? And he just colored it all in black. No, no, it was black cover. And uh, I can feel the raised on the white. That is just awesome. Come on, Jum. There's adventure ahead. <laughs> that is so awesome. I don't even want... I, I'm happy now. And I got another one to open. <laughs> That's so awesome. I'm... Ruben killed it, brother. That tick cover, oh my god. I don't even care about it. It doesn't matter what else I get. That's just like awesome sauce. Whew. All right. So let's put that out of the way. First up, we have Justice League Incarnate, issue 405. So this is signed by Dennis Culver again. The multiverse is dying, and it's all your fault. There's a gar piece of garbage. No, I'm just saying that because I want Burke to know it's a piece of garbage. No. Go, go, Power Rangers. 
Uh, this is an exclusive variant, issue number one. And this is uh, Ian Nichols, the featured artist. There. Go, go, Power Rangers. Ooh, hot book. Hot title that's really gotten great. Great. This is the great cover right here. The B covers. Uh, here we got Tom Taylor doing Nightwing. Uh, you got Nightwing here. Tom Taylor si signing. That is great. Look at Dick Grayson. That is amazing. God, there's a lot of good books in here. Oh. Some X-Men. I know some people love, love them. Some Oh, this is... Pow okay, Powers of X. Jonathan Hickman signed. That's good. How about... A double signed book, Justice League, issue 43. Look at that. And this is signed by uh, Richard Friend and David Barron. And here we have the all new, all different Savage Avengers. And this is signed by uh, Mirka Andolfo. What is Black Widow against a Predator? Oh, this is a versus Predator variant cover. Okay. Cool. There's another one of those Acts of Helena's. The 1 in 100's. So I will definitely uh, probably... This is number 25 out of 100. So I'll, I may... Um, these are so crispy. Holy cow, because they're such a small run. Almost want to sit there and send them all in. Problem is, being signed like that, uh, CGC, we just green label those Sons of Guns. So um, definitely want to do that. Oh my goodness. Holy cow. Ian Nichols again. Must love. I don't even know what cover this. Co Oof. How about a Superman? Superman blank? Whatever. Issue number one. They got Doomsday. Look at that Doomsday. I assume that's Doomsday. It looks like Doomsday to me. That is incredible. Yeah, it says Doomsday sketch cover. I can read the back, sir. Look at that. That is amazing. Dude, such high contrast and stuff. I'm just curious if the backs are... Okay, yeah. There's no wraparound on it. I was going to say, that would have been just in... <laughs> insane. Holy cow. Two incredibly awesome sketch covers. Great job. Oh my goodness. Smoke if you got them. Ruben. How you doing? I'm so stu I'm so pumped. Super excited, man. Great, great mystery box. Guys, uh, I'll li put link to IRF Authentics um, there right down below so you can make sure you check them out because uh, you might want to give them a follow so you can get on these boxes next time. If you're into signed books. If you're not into signed books, well then, I don't know, collect what you want. Don't listen to me. I'm just a fat man with a fat stack of comics and a fat opinion. Thanks for watching.